dit que on bouge. Mais papa qui mais papa qui dit non. On a bien on a bien on a bien. Mais ben non pas qui qui m'a voilà qui bon moi qui. Bouge. Escrabe. Yo bébé sur le monde. Bouge. Bouge de bébé mais papa qui qui fait la magie. Non ma. Non ma. Non ma. Uzo, I don't like the look on your face. What's the problem? Why did you bring me out? Olama, she cannot make it. So that's not true. She can. You can make her come true. Child delivery is so specialty. You can. I know. But this particular case is different. I just can't face it. There are things that are forces fighting over the baby. I mean, there are forces fighting over the delivery. I don't know what to do. Forces. So, what can we do now, please? What can we do? There is only one way out. Which is? <laughs> no. Don't even suggest that, please. Don't. It is life for a life, Norma. And you know it. Don't worry. There is some good script. They will guide the baby. Oh. But my daughter will die in the process. So what makes them good? You can't talk me out of this. Me, 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 this pain is too much. I wish there's something I could do to avoid this pain. I'm so sorry. I did not tell you. 
about the father of my unborn child. Did you do that? Is that what you have to say? Don't you know that if you hear something like that, you do a mother. You heal me. Do a moon now. 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 Eh? That is what men do. Especially when you eat good food. Huh? But is that why you have to do that? <laughs> it shows you don't have respect for me. Mm. I will not marry you again. Eh? What did I just say? Yes, you heard me. Me too. I will not marry you again. Take it from me. Look at what you're saying to me. Again. You said it first. But I was just joking now. I never meant that. And what do you mean? Oh. So this is what is in your mind, right? You are a bad man. Yes, and I hate you. I will not marry you again. Listen to me. I hate you too. After this, just go and pack your things and leave this house. Please. Please. Princess, you look so beautiful today. All thanks to you for your great work. Thank you very much. My beautiful princess. Happy celebrations. <laughs> Happy bond day. Thank you, mother. You look so adorable. Thank you, mother. Oh, thanks, you, Dosa. My God. <laughs> well, I think I should get back to being adorned. <laughs> My king, my queen, princess of Ugweke kingdom. Your star shines today. The palace is filled with men and women from the four corners of the village. They've come bearing different gifts to commemorate your bonding. Thank you very much. Tell them I'll be with them soon. Yes, What is it? I was thinking that the next people to enter this compound will be Adora's parents to call off the engagement. Nah, you know nah. That, that, that is not possible. I love Adora. Just that she's sometimes... Say it. She's what? Nothing. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> you <laughs> two will never see to embarrass me. If you're a young man, you can't build your own heart. And here, I decide who comes in and who goes out. You, what are you doing? Get out! Out! <laughs> no, father, father! Father, 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 what's this now? What's this now? Do you know what it took me to, to, to convince this girl? Will you shut up? Have you gone mad? Are you mad as any? I'm, 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 I'm asking you. If I take the name, you're a fool. You're a cow. You're a monkey. Every day you bring in different women into this house. Is that how you want to waste your life? Eh? I'm asking you. For I'm a man. For I'm a grown man. I'm not that there's any boy you used to know. I'm a man now. You're a man. You're a grown man. That 
is why you have to make good use of your time and energy. Isn't it? I cannot continue allow you to bring shame to a household. No, I will not take that from you. Rubbish. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. That reminds me. Today is Princess Oledo's born day. If I were you, I would look for a befitting gift for her. What, 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 what's my business with her? Why are you telling me that? See why I say you a fool. You have been away for too long. Now that you are back, you need to put things right. Think. Eh? Father, 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 this one is bad. You don't, you don't just know what you just did to me now. Father, this, this one is this one is bad. This thing is bad. Father. Oh, God of our land, why now? I'm almost out, Papa. Adugo! 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 Onyana <laughs> will be a funny to ya. What is it? My leg, my leg. Your leg? Yes. You need to dislocate? Mm-hmm. Something like that. Is this something like that? Or exactly that? Yes, uh, I mean no. Adora, when will you stop being mischievous? When? I'm tired of this place. Can't you see it's raining? Come, let's go. Lazy woman is I'm tired of this place. Let's go. It's better to be lazy than to be a tibia like you. <laughs> Yeah, my leg. Yeah. Let's go. Chick food again. Ah, I'm tired though. Huh? I only want you to get focused. Hmm? And you will learn this. It's very simple. Hmm? I told you the name of this sling. Before. Cha 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 What is it? Huh? No, no. What is it? Abacha. Okay, okay, okay. Come this side, come this side. You are still the best in Norma. And see that old age has not affected your huge appetite for my food. At all. Mm. <laughs> I still remember those mm. old good days. You are blessed by the gods. Mm. Who is he? He's a nudge. Yeah? Is this Nine Nachi, the great Tibia? Hey! Ichi, you're welcome. You're welcome. May the gods bless you, my son. You're welcome. Thank you, my son. I've heard so much about you and your exploits. I never knew that this day would come. I never knew that I would be alive to set my eyes on you. <laughs> ne? You didn't tell me you knew him. We grew up together too quickly. But Mare separated us. Hey, whoa. I brought him here 
So he can take you along with him to Gwege to perfect your gifts. Ne, are you trying to tell me that someday I am going to be great like Nainachi? <laughs> you can do better. You are favored of the gods. Hi! Nai, you welcome. are favored of the gods. You're welcome. Thank you. Ah! Aswa Dronania! Dora, please stop this. You want to leave me? Everybody, you're wicked, you're wicked. But I'm not wicked, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, my dear, I'm sorry. Yeah? My love for medicine has brought the greatest Tibia that ever lived to my house. The gods brought him to make me become a better Dibia. What about me? What about me, Ebube? I heard that Tugweke has beautiful women. They will take you away from Nobody me. Nobody is going to take me away from you. <laughs> you are the most beautiful woman under the sun. Hey? I will return once I gain mastery of my gift. I love you. I just want to become a better man for you. Baby, I would die if you leave me. Please don't say it. Please don't say it. You will not die. Before you know it, I will return. I promise. Stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> Because of the weather. And you know we are going there. We have a very long distance. Yeah. Okay, they're coming out. Please, nah. Please take good care of him. He's all I have. Huh? I will do that. You are handing him over to me because you know with me, he will be in good hands. My grandson here mm. eats too much. Good. I eat a lot too, and that makes us one. So we can make our move. Hmm? <laughs> no much here, love. <laughs> Please stay out of trouble. Yes. I will, ne. Welcome to my abode, great one. 
I am not worthy to be called great. Time shall tell. Go in there and rest while I go and look for something for us to eat. Thank you, great one. A new dawn has come. Because the great idea of our life. A complete man. Hey, I'm a complete man. I don't know what happened to them. Maybe it's stress. Then get enough rest. Come. I can't find it. What's what's what happened? What happened to me? Father! 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 What is it? What Father. is it? Father! 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 I can't find it. You can't find what? Father, I can't find. Father, I can't... Talk now, are you a stammerer? You can't find what? Father, I understand. I can't find it, I can't... Oh, that. You can't find it. Uh -huh. Go inside. Maybe you forgot it under the bed. This is a serious business. I, I, am, I am useless without this thing. It's a lie. You are not useless without it. I think you are a better man without it. <laughs> Father, do something. I'm your soul. I'm your, I'm your soul. I'm your, I'm your blood. <laughs> Father... Nai, Nachi! Nai, Nai! 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 Nai, He's still alive. Take him under the street. Why you not to yourself? Where have you won? The great deed of our life. My husband. I think that is too extreme. The boy needed to be taught some hard lessons. Otherwise, we'll lose him. And you know what that means. Our hope of finally clinging to power would have been defeated by, by his useless lifestyle. I understand. But it will kill him the more. What are you estimating? That I give it back to him so he can continue wreaking havoc? What I think is this. I think it's time we let him know. And also time we consummated his marriage with the princess. Indian I have never seen a thing like this.
His body is bony. Greetings, the great Dibia of our time. The king requests your presence in the palace. Is it right now, wise one. Everybody. Wise one. Look after me. I will be back soon. His destiny to be great. His destiny to be higher. The great Libya of our land. There is a growing epidemic in the entire kingdom of Ugweke. Children are dying in their numbers. So far we have recorded about five deaths. And the fear has escalated among pregnant women and uh, nursing mothers. Uh, Dibia, what could the problem be? My king, I have never seen anything like this before. That does not answer my question, Dibia. You are the best physician that we have around here. And you should be able to tell us what the problem is and what the solution should be. I will need to take my time and find out what the problem is and come back with the solution. Please do that quickly. Come back with the antidote. That I will do without delay, my king. Father, you mean to tell me that all this while you've been fighting me over bringing medicine in this house, the beautiful princess of this kingdom was betrothed to me? Yes. Hi. So I'm to marry the princess, the most beautiful girl in this kingdom? As a near, yes. Hi. Why didn't you tell me this thing since? Now is the right time. So I will, I will rule this kingdom. If you will eschew foolishness, you will rule this kingdom. Of course I will. Are we in agreement then? <laughs> Father, yes. <laughs> Father, where are you going to? I'm going inside. What about? Oh, that. You will receive it as a marriage gift from me. Father, how do I operate? How do I operate in this village? I said you will receive it as a marriage gift. Don't you have ears? It's not fair. How do I operate? How do I? I couldn't is there. Goodness is there. You look guys there. All these girls, how do I operate now? But father. Father. one. I tried my best. It is not your fault. What do we do now? We need solution. Prepare the church for them. Ebu bemwa jibi uwa jibi uwa Ebu bi jibi uwa Ye jibi uwa Mo jibi uwa Banche ni dupa uwa in the midst of darkness, the ground light is on. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
chi kwa ko bie onyo yo na chi anti ni zu ni fa de mi ya zam zam wa bie lu wa bie ga na chi kwa ko bie ebu be chi kwa ko wa bie u ebu be wa na wa ya zam zam wa bie lu wa bie ga na chi kwa ko bie He's destined to be great. He's destined to be high. When you're not to yourself, everyone. Be great, be the idea of our life. Great, great one. I wish that was true. It is true. You are the greatest physician alive. Yet, these innocent children keep dying in their numbers right before me and I cannot do anything to stop it. I've heard so much about you and your curative power. I followed you because I believe in you. We will find the cure. Maybe I'm not as powerful as Dickie, who once brought victory and honor to us. How do you mean? So many years ago. You will go to Ugwoke and then you send for the Long live King of Ugwoke. Obioso, may you live long. Why are you breathing like someone being chased by a monster? Mouth cannot explain. But my eye just saw this morning, my king. What did you see? Speak already. They paid Ugweke a visit last night. It swept the entire village and took many with it. How? How did this happen? Which is why I say, Mouth cannot explain what my eye just saw. This I'm a job. In that case, get the royal fleet ready and then send for the chief priest immediately. Yes, my king. King, go now. How did this happen? I've done such a thing. My king, I can bet you this must be the handiwork of Uta people. Uta? Why would they do that? Because they're the only people that always attacked us without any provocation. But how can Uta people invade us in this manner? Don't we have guards 
watching over this land? Did we have guards watching over the land? Oh, man! Get away from the bodies, all of you! Oh, brother, oh, brother. Oh, brother, oh, brother, oh, brother. Oh, brother, oh, brother, oh, brother, oh, brother, oh, brother, for burial. Exactly. There is no need for that. 
The king is in distress. The king is troubled. But the king has to eat something and relax his nerves in order for it to function properly. The king has many concerns right now. And food is least among those concerns. After what I saw, how can I sit and eat when the kingdom is littered with putrefying corpses? The worst is that we do not even know the cause of their death. I understand your concern, my husband. They are my concerns as well. Please, come with me. King, it has been two days since that sad event occurred. If you noticed, the chief priest left without a word. Ubeke is now living in an aggressive fear of the unknown. My king, something has to be done to douse the alarming tension in the land. Well, so, what do you propose we do, Ibe? That we guard ourselves against further incursion. Because I am persuaded that Uja, Uja actually masterminded that action that took place two days ago. Yeah. And someone in a council meeting immediately. Then let me, let me send out words. Elders in council. Ugueke is in grave danger. And we cannot sit and watch the people of Uja poke their hands in our eyes. We must stand up to protect our land, our women, and our children, lest we be annihilated. My king, you have spoken well. However, I will advise we consider diplomacy in our approach to this matter. How do you mean, Ichiba? My king, I suggest we first send emissaries to Uja for them to explain why they invaded our land unprovoked? We need answers from them. Oh, what are you saying? Look at, can you imagine? Look at, what are you saying, Mazuba? Are you okay? Oh, you are suggesting we send emissaries to, 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 to those cannibals. Now, let me tell you something. You better know this. If you dare send emissaries to them, they will send their skulls back to us. That is how cannibals respond to stupid questions. That's true. Please. Mazibe, don't disparage me just to make a point. I have the right to, to make my suggestion here, just like you. Uh -uh. My king. Ichiba is right. Oh, 
he has the right to air his mind. Mazibe, I counsel you to refrain from using demeaning words on fellow elders. It does not go well for relationship in the palace. I am so sorry, my king. Uh, Mazuba, I'm so sorry. I hereby tender my unreserved apology. But, my king, I am burdened. I honestly, I'm burdened. And the only way I will be happy is that we hit them back. Reprisal attack, that's what I'm talking about, my king. Reprisal attack? Nkase. Yes, my king. How many men can you boast of? 5,000 able bodied men, my king. Prepare the combatants. Beautiful, what? my now king. Wait my instruction. Right away, my king. Humans and their police looking for answers and solutions in odd places. Ugweka is facing an existential threat that has transcended directions. And at not even 5,000 foot soldiers can put up a fight. You are simply chasing shadows. Uja is not responsible for the deaths. The Uchi clan is responsible. Uchi clan? Uchi clan. Hmm. Uchi clan. Uh, well, uh, elders, peace. Uh, peace. Wise one. Are you sure of what you just said? Uh, my king, I beg to differ from what wise one said. Uchi clan is more or less a myth, an allegory at best, handed down to us by our forefathers. Now let me tell you, in those days they used it to dissuade us from doing anything wrong. So it has never existed and it will not start existing now. How foolish of you to think that this is a myth. My king, when I placed my hands on one of the dead. I was taken back in time. I saw how they did it. I saw them all. They are fierce and deadly. Unless we find a lasting solution. Unless we find a lasting solution, then we come back and make what we already experienced look like a mere rehearsal. They believe the land belongs to them and they want it back. Speaking of riddles. My king, the Uchi clan tricked our forefathers into ceding this land to them. They brought wealth. Our people lived in plenitude. They were happy at that time. This land flowed with milk and honey and became envy of many other communities, including Uja people, but unknown to our ancestors. The Uja people had their own agenda. Evil multiplied. They sodomized the land. Yeah, our fathers became sad and vowed to take their land and chased him. But they didn't have the supernatural way power to do so. 
What did they do? They brought in a necromancer. Hmm. What about the elders? I doubt if they will consent to this. Sorcery was abolished from this kingdom so many years ago. And we cannot be dragged into it. It is very funny that you believed sorcery was once perpetrated on this kingdom. But you do not believe that Uchi clan once lived among us. Eh? We have a need. A need to salvage this kingdom and save ourselves from total annihilation from a monstrous and cannibalistic clan. Imagine, Oba, Oba, I want to see your Please sit down. Please sit down. Sit down. Sit down. The question here is in the absence of already preferred solutions, what do we do? That's what we should be asking ourselves. Not a dream here and there. What do we do? Um, Igwe, 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 Igwe. My king, Igwe. I'm, sorry. My king I'm so sorry. Uh, see, if you ask me, I think that the best thing to do is just to... Igwe, 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 my king, you look troubled. I am faced between the devil and the deep blue sea. Should I accept a helping hand from the devil or fall into the deep blue sea? If I refuse to accept the helping hand from the devil, will I be able to swim my way out of the deep blue sea? You are the king. Whatever decision you make, I will stand by you. The gods will stand by you. The elders think otherwise. Does it matter? Your father. Your grandfather, your great grandfather, faced challenges that seemed irredeemable. But they conquered. I know my husband will conquer. You really believe that? I do. Thank you. What can a king do without the rare and well defined wisdom of a beautiful and delectable queen like you? <laughs> you complete me, you know. Thank you, my king. <laughs> My king, you need a massage. Oh. After you? Let me get the meds. My king, if you sanction this, we may not be able to get out of it. We have to thread with caution. As much as I want us to be free, but we do not have to mortgage our future and that of our children. I know. But no one has been able to provide a superior solution to the one already proposed. And you heard the chief priest. They will come back. And if they do, how will we be able to stop them from wrecking havoc? <clears throat> With due respect, my king, I am not a party to this. I'm sorry. Ibe. I don't mean any insults, please. That's my opinion.
Ticket would have a you sleep too much, Tiki. A man of your caliber ought not to be written. You are a warrior. I think I'm going to be a warrior. But it is unusual for the priest of Ubueke to pay me a visit. What have I left undone? Extraordinary situations call for extraordinary measures. How do you know if it is bad? I just want to make sure that you are not going to be a fool. I don't want to be a fool. I don't want to be a fool. Ubueke stands on the precipice. And only you can save her. Wise one, if you just now when you need to know where I am, you have given me yam without palm oil to digest it. Come with me, Dike. I'm going to go get you some more. My king, I think we should have a rethink on this. A man such as DK, whose lineage is notorious for their likeness for evil, cannot be of any use to us. Um, I understand your concerns, Ibe. In the absence of solutions already proposed, what other ways can we solve this problem? Um, the chief priest promised that as soon as this mission is completed, he will revoke Dickie's powers. So, we don't have anything to worry about. Well, uh, if, uh, uh... My king! It has happened again! The dead leaders the entire kingdom! What? How many dead? Women and children, numbering in their 50. 50? 50! My yes, king! Sir. That is outrageous, my king! Really outrageous? Ibe! We must not take it soft with this people of Uchi clan. We must do what we must to salvage our people from these dreaded and draconian people who have invaded our place. We must. We have to, my king. As it pleases my king. The look on your face suggest doubt, decay. Blame me not, wise one. I am a warrior and I fight and destroy enemies that I see. The only enemy that I don't see is the only enemy that is afraid of me or does not exist. This is a spiritual warfare. The principalities here have outlived the greatest of the greatest warriors. If you must fight and defeat them. If you must fight and defeat them. You need more than these little windows on your face. Look beyond the ordinary. What if I don't make it back? What if I am trapped there? What becomes of Ugweke? Then we are doomed for eternity. But you must come back. You must come back. So that you and your children may yet live to tell the story. Understand. I want you to know that if it were all well up in the trees, 
the hawk wouldn't have come down to look for the chicken. Ugweke is washing her way. What about me? What about our born child? That is the point. That is the point I'm making. If I don't embark on this journey, there will be no you. Or, or the unborn child that will cater for you. Please. It's not fair. It's not fair. <laughs>
Show yourself if you're not afraid of Dicock. Show yourself. You have eyes, but you can't see. How can you defeat someone you cannot see? My advice for you is to go back and await the horror that is coming to you and your ungrateful people. Ingrid! You have nothing against my people. Why have you come here? To send you back to Hades, where you rightly belong. So are you the one who will complete what your ancestors couldn't complete 200 years ago? <laughs> Go back, little one. I am Dickog. Dickie Wu Dewe. I hate being called a little one. Ugweke sleeps with one eye open. For the enemies lurk around in the shadows of uncertainty. Oba. Kaijuan Diana. Ebili. Ebili. Hemaron is in a twelve. Akuaka. Akuaka, we are going to have a new day. Ezio, we are going to have a new day. We are going to have family for a day is coming when we shall put all this behind us hey thank you wise one we are counting on that day hey and look when in a proposal for you. We've seen you're very powerful and we think you fit to pilot our affairs in Ugweke. How do you mean by that? We shall let you live. We shall remove the king and install you as king. You will rule with strength and majesty. You will have immeasurable wealth. What do you say? You are a familiar spirit. And you understand the strength and weakness of those you torment. But I tell you this. When a child refuses to understand what killed his father, he will die by that which killed his father. I have one mission here. That mission is to destroy you. And I, Dikogo, 
Dike wu debe of Ugweke kingdom will and must destroy you.
His destiny to be higher. One year not to your summer, everyone. The great need of our life. You are awake. Thank the gods. I have waited for a season and a half for you to stand on your feet looking strong. What? Yes. That is how long you've been asleep. How did I get here? I saw you lying helplessly close to the stream. I brought you here to heal. How did you get there? Do you remember a thing? Not much. I was in a fight. A fight? With who? Uchi. Do you know Uchi? Uchi. No, I don't even know them. You said them. How did you know I was not talking about a single person? Because you are a great warrior by nature. It will take more than 50 men to pull you down. And how come you are as beautiful as a native of Uchi? What was that for? Why did you do that? You look hungry. I will make you food. Da 
about the cool breeze. The sweet silence. The peace. Nature is my family. And I like it here. What about the people? The people. Yes. My people rejected me for a crime my father committed. And I think. So, how did it happen? A story I don't want to talk about. Intention. It won't happen again. Stay. Please don't go. I need you. It's okay. No, 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 no. I would no, 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 Am I finally home? Yes. You are finally home. Welcome back from the land of the spirits. Thank you, wise one. Thank you. <laughs> How long have I been away? You've been away for eight seasons. Eight seasons? Yes. Hey. It feels like yesterday. You went to a place where time doesn't count. <laughs> Dicky, go see your family. 
Take your wise one. <laughs> Dike, wise one. Did you defeat the Uchi clan? Yes, wise one. Oh. I did. Besides the power to kill and destroy, which has beauty that no man with blood flowing through his loins can resist, they have used this singular attribute to defeat kings and conquer territories. If you slept with any of them, it means you have chased them away through the front door and opened the back door for them to come back. Wise one, they will never come back. <laughs> they will never torment us again. Very God, be praised! Dick, your family awaits you. Looking like my husband. Olaku, I am your husband. and blood, my husband. What is your name? Mm -hmm. Ezenia. So you named him as I instructed. Greetings too. The news of your return and victory have swept the entire Uweke. And the king has asked me to inform you there will be a feast to celebrate your return and victory. Go back and tell the king that I shall honor his invitation.
Thank you. Today is a very important day in the annals of our history as a united Uweke people. A day that I never thought will ever come to pass. A day that only existed in my thoughts and in my dreams. Finally, today came and we are celebrating the defeat of our mortal enemy. The gods handed our ancestors victory over the Uchi clan. And today, they have given us the same victory. <laughs> our eternal gratitude goes to one man. The gods chosen to lead the onslaught against the beasts that have terrified us over time. That man is DK. DK. Your Majesty. Come and kneel before me. You have brought back victory king. to your fatherland. And we do not know how to repay you for this great sacrifice that you made. How can we possibly repay you? Can we? We cannot. And that is why until the end of time you shall continue to be celebrated this day every year. I will ask that you make a request of anything and you shall have it. What can I possibly ask my king? You honored me amongst men choosing me to embark on this job. That is the more reason we are saying that you deserve more than showers of praises. Go ahead and ask for anything, DK, and you shall have it. I never expected to be given anything. Yet I cannot refuse my king. <laughs> but I think uh, I should be given more time to think about my choice, my king, my king. Of course, you have all the time. Igwe. <laughs> <laughs>
okay. I'm ready to see the priest over your dream. Who are you? And how did you know about the tree? Because I've not told anyone about it. Who I am is not important. I know a lot about your dream. Another thing is that the answer you seek is not with the priest. Okay. Tell me about the dream if you know so much. You wore the revered crown and sat in the most respected place of Ugueta. Another thing I know is that the answer you seek does not lie with the priest. Yes, you are right. Does that mean that the, the gods want me to be the king of Ugueta? Huh? Okay, if that is the case, how do I tell the king that the gods of Ugueke want me to be their heir? Ike, I never thought you are this power hungry. But here is wisdom for you. What if you produce the next king of Ugweke that the king cannot produce? Think about it. Think about it. I never, I never thought, thought you are this, this power, power hungry. But well, here, here is wisdom, wisdom for you. For you. What, what if you do the next, the next king, king of Mwekweke that, that the king cannot, cannot produce? Think, think, think about, about it. it. Think, think about, about it. it. My king, as I was saying, uh, such a demand. Princesses don't marry commoners. You 
are a great man of this kingdom. I adjure you to ask for something else. Apart from that, my friend, there is no... My king, as much as his demand grace me, you can do nothing about this matter. The elders in council are congregating. They are congregating. They have been in situation and counter is measure. There is no heir to the throne. And the only way to keep those nosy elders out of the throne room is to honor your word. Can't be serious, my king. I know how you feel, my queen. I feel worse. But I made a promise to the man that brought back victory and honor to this great land. I made that promise before the entire people of Wake. The people already love DK for what he did. If I renege on my promise, then it will set me as a bad king before the people. Please understand. I find it very difficult to understand. Greetings, my king. You ask my presence. Send words across. Sound it through the length and bread of Ugweke. The princess, my daughter, will be betrothed to Ezenna, the son of Dike. Obviously, it's not right. The kings marry other daughters to princes from other kingdoms to strengthen out the alliances with them. But in this case, it is not so. And to wasn't the issue. The said man is a commoner, just like you and I. Exactly, my brother. Exactly. Since the king now give out the princess to commoners, he should have as well given her to me. After all, I am a better man than the other man. And I will make a better husband to the princess. Better man indeed. Of course. What do you mean the better man, Eputa? <laughs> what do you mean? Look at me. Why are you laughing? I am better, of course. Can't you see? You're jealous. Yes. Can you see the better man? You are still laughing. Oh, maybe you are jealous. I can see. You are jealous. What were you discussing about? And what is your business with what we are talking about? I can see your parents did not teach you how to respect superior beings. <laughs> <laughs> superior being? And who is the superior being here? Ah! 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 
please, please, don't kill me, please, don't kill me, please, don't kill me. Spare my life. I promise I will not tell anyone, please. Because, 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 please, please, don't kill me, please, don't kill me. Please, don't kill me. What is it? I can't do this again. Why? You have been like this since you returned. You don't touch me anymore. You don't make me feel like the woman you married. I don't understand. Don't you find me adorable anymore? Don't say that. Don't say that. Why not? Are you seeing another woman? No. Then what is the problem? Is it not more working? I don't know how to explain this. Something is happening to me. Something is happening to me. I killed two men yesterday. Hey! How? What did they do to you? Nothing. They only expressed their displeasure over the king. Giving out the princesses and the marriage to us. I don't want to do anything. It was as if a force took over me and made me to kill those young men. A force? I don't understand. I thought they took your power away when you returned. How come about this? Husband, this is bad. You need to tell the priest. No, I can't do that. Do, do you want them to burn me to death? No, no, no. But what do we do? I don't know. The only thing I know we should do is to keep our mouth shut. Hey. Hey. You killed. How oh, innocent people. Wise one, this story is very long and terrible. But wise one, I don't want to know what Dike has achieved. I know you, and I know you can do greater things for this kingdom. You are my idol. You are my inspiration. Strong for me. And for the children lying over there, helplessly. Please, wise one, be strong.
and he was beaten by a black mamba. And it's impossible for the wound and the pain to disappear like that. Impossible, you said. Is that why you have allowed the children to die? But I don't have the power to kill them. You are a god, Ibuli. Always remember that. prepared something that we will give to the sick children. Please, how sure are you about this? By the gods, I'm sure it will work. Please go and administer it to them. His destiny to be great. His destiny to be higher. When you're not to yourself, wherever you want. It works. Ni 
Averting the disease that would have killed all our children. Thank you, my king. I would as much like to take credit for this noble achievement. But I cannot do that. I was as confused as everyone here. I did not know what to do. I was afraid we could lose the whole children. Until my protege here came with the solution. My king. My elders, I present Ebube to you. He is the one who deserves the praises. He found the cure. Um, young man, is that true? Yes, my king. Are you one of my sons in this kingdom? My king, I'm from Amaoku. You salute your bravery. In due time, you shall be rewarded for this act. Thank you, my king. Igwe Great one, I cannot tell. Something came upon me. All of a sudden I found myself inside the bush. Then I came back with a solution. I think it's time for me to step aside, for you to step up. I don't understand. I did not expect that you start manifesting your gifts so soon. My gift? Your gift, of course. It was not accident that you brought the solution that killed the children. You were born for a day like this. A day that Ugweke will be lifted from its course forever. I am Udoka. Did you not see that young man? Yes, I did. I mean, tell me which girl wouldn't be happy after seeing such a fine young man. Although I've not had a word with him, but I feel helplessly attached to him already. I think I want to meet him again. My princess, are you fantasizing? Is that stupidity? No, it's, it's just that. Let's... maybe. I want to see him again. <laughs> Make it happen. <laughs> I have come as we agreed some years ago. To remind you that the children are of age and it will be right to consummate the marriage. Time is of essence. 
You have spoken well, DK. Great man of our land. I shall honor my word to you and your family. I shall also notify my daughter and then send words to you. Thank you very much. I shall take my leave. His destiny to be great. His destiny to be high. When you're not to yourself, wherever you are, be great the idea of our life. Princess wants to see me? Yes. Is she sick? Or is she burning with temperature? No, she just wants to see you. Okay then. I'll be there later. If I were you, I wouldn't keep the princess waiting. You mean now? Yes, now. Greetings, my princess. Greetings, Ebubi. Greetings, my princess. You have done a thing of wonder just as your name suggests. It's an honor, my princess. Indeed. Walk with me. What do you like to do? I like to hear the sick. Well, maybe someday you will teach me how to care for the sick. Mm -mm. It's a dirty job. You cannot do it. Why? And it's not befitting for a princess like you. Why don't I be the judge of that? Tell me about yourself. There is nothing to tell about myself. With all due respect, my delectable princess, I would like to get back to my job. Did you see that cute smile on his face? He carries himself with so much charisma and pride. He is every inch the man of my dream. My princess, you are moving too fast. Really? Well, they say speed is good. At least it makes one get there faster. <laughs> Mother, am I in some kind of trouble? Because I have been sitting here for a while and you two haven't said anything to me, except stare at me. Well, um, there's something we would like to share with you. It's about your marriage. <laughs> Father, you're very funny. 
For a moment, I thought I was in some kind of trouble. Well, marriage is a beautiful thing. And I have been getting disturbances from potential suitors. But I haven't found any man worthy yet. I'll let you know when I find one. But that's not exactly what I mean, my princess. So what exactly do you mean? Um, someone has already been picked for you. And you're to get married in a fortnight. <laughs> Father, you have been joking all day. <laughs> this is a joke, right? <laughs> it's not a joke, my daughter. Yes, it is a joke. I can see it on your faces. <laughs> Because I'm happy today, I would just go in there and act like we did not have this conversation. <laughs> mm. I knew this was going to happen. I knew she will never accept this. You have to talk to her. This is a very serious matter and you must let her see it that way. believe this. Mother, you and father sold me out. My daughter don't talk like that. It's not what you... That is how I feel right now. How could you, mother, giving out a girl who doesn't know anything about marriage, a girl who doesn't even know her left from her right, what were you thinking? That I wouldn't grow to have my own choice? The circumstances were beyond our control. What's the circumstances were? I really don't. I would not marry a Zenna. That, that man whose sight I can't even withstand. Oledo, don't talk like that. He's not bad. He's a handsome man. Other, please leave. I want to be left alone. Please just leave. I want you to sleep over I would not waste my sleep over that. I have better thoughts to sleep over. My daughter, I want you to forgive us for what we did to you. We did it not because we hated you. We did it because we love you. Love. How can you translate your act against me to love for me? How? Oledo, we have laws in this land. You're my only child. And it was expedient for me to give out your hand in marriage if the throne is to remain in this family. Since I don't have a male child. But this is a power move, Father. My respect, my right to choose, my pride and self-esteem was sacrificed on the altar of power. That is not true, Oledo. We did it for you. You will be queen and you will rule over this kingdom with your husband. Yes, Father, I want to be queen and I want to rule over this kingdom. But with my own kind of husband. Not your kind, Father. <laughs> What you ask me for today, one I might not have an answer to give today, but tomorrow I might have an answer. You asked to see me. Is that the way you address your husband? my husband now let me tell you you are living in fool's paradise 
or you probably woke up on the wrong side of your bed. I am not your wife, never had, and never will. It's okay, I, I understand your, your playing hard to get. It's, it's natural. But let me tell you what you don't understand. You see this, your beautiful skin? All belongs to me. You are my wife. Oh my goodness. Let me tell you one thing you don't know. I am the son of the strongest man of this kingdom, DK. You're my wife. I must get you whether you like it or not. This is not good. This is not good at all. How can my parents be so, so reckless and mean at the same time? Why would they give me out to a man who doesn't have a term of respect for women? You need to have seen the way he spoke to me the other day like I'm some cheap maiden in the kingdom. Why do women give birth to such, such kind of men? Why can't they give birth to reasonable men? This is, this is absurd! Oh, I can't, can't even take it anymore. Ah, it's so did, you, did you see anyone here? Anyone like who? It's just you, I and my mates. I... I thought I... Never mind. So you haven't been listening to me the whole time? What is wrong with everyone? Why is anyone not listening to me? I, I do want to listen to you. No, you were not. If you were, you would have known that I love you. Um... I... Did I, did I just, did I just say that? I, I, I didn't, I, I didn't mean it that way. I, I, I'm sorry. He's destined to be great. He's destined to be Again? So it's true what I hear. That you got abilities to see beyond the physical. What do you want? I should be the one asking you the question after seeing you with my daughter in law. Ebube, you are treading on a dangerous ground. Is Hurry that... for thunder. Is that so? What do you really want from her? The throne is mine. No! The man standing before me has been inhabited by that past. Who are you? And what is your mission here? He who dances the dance of the spirit does not know that the dance of the spirit is the dance of the dead. Stay away. Everybody stay away! In the midst of darkness, never more light to the sun. As the girl, not you You are wasting our time, DK. I need more time. More time? You have not made good use of the ones given to you. 
and you are seeking for more. Every day that passes by, Ebube's power grows. And in no time, his powers can no longer be contained. You are our only hope. The only way into this kingdom. We need to gain control over the kingdom by consummating the marriage to the princess. And when that is done, we shall return and take what rightfully belongs to us. Fail! Fail, DK, and you shall be consumed. He refused? I think this is not too good. Uwe can a crown prince and princess. That is the tradition. Don't I know that already? She has become too witty and unyielding these days. I never knew she would grow to be like that. My king, uh, you have to persuade her to accept the young man. You really have to. Otherwise, your right to this throne may even come to an end. I'm afraid. The heart of the king, my sunshine. Put a smile on your face. Father, please, this will not work. We are not having this discussion. My daughter, I want you to see why this has to work. Aside from being traditionally mandatory that the princess must marry a man who will be her husband and rule with her, the man in question, you already be to the man in question. Point of correction, father. Little Oledo was the one who was betrothed to that man. I have grown and I reserve the right to choose who I want to settle down with. If you want me to get married as quickly as possible, then I might as well bring a man of my choice. Oh, it does not work that way, my dear. It has to work the way we have always done it here. I'm sorry to disappoint you, Father. My answer remains no. <laughs> My king, I find it so difficult to believe that your daughter, Oledo, refused to honor our agreement. Dike, I, uh, so you call your king a liar? No, I'm not saying that, my king. I'm only saying that it is not right. Something has to be done, and very fast. Time is no longer on my side. It has to take place immediately because a lot depends on it. Dick, I don't understand. You sound so desperate. Is there something I don't know you want to tell me? No, my king. No, 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 no. There is nothing like that. I am just concerned about the throne and the legacy that took you so many years of tedious and torturous hard work to build. A child should not waste it. That's what I'm saying. Something has to be done. Very quickly. Very quickly. My king, my queen. Supposed to come with my daughter for breakfast. My queen, something has gone wrong with the princess. What do you mean that something has gone wrong? I went there to call her for breakfast, but she refused to talk to me. You know my daughter very well. She's so twisted. My queen, the princess talks to me even when she doesn't want to talk to anyone. I think something is wrong. Who is that? 
What is it? And why are you crying? My princess. What has happened to her? She lies in her room. She's not moving and she's not talking to anybody. I think you should come. The king says you should come. Okay, go. I'll, I'll, I'll be there soon. Okay. you are, wherever you're coming from, I destroy you now! In the midst of darkness, She's not responding to the medicine. Something is wrong. You are not having that injury on your face a while ago. It's not something I couldn't take care of. What you say is wrong with my daughter? She's so stubborn that the gods of the land are angry with her. What should we do, wise one? Please. Me. You have until four market days to get her married to the truth. Come out now! Come out! Come out! Are you not tired of following me? Are you not tired? How can we be tired when our enemies roam the kingdom unhindered? How? Since you've made it abundantly clear that I'm your enemy, I am going to tell you this. One more time, and if you fail to yield, you shall be consumed 
by my fiery anger. Undo what you've done to the princess. <laughs> I can see you are very much in love with the princess. But sorry to tell you this. She will be married to my son in four days. That will never happen. I don't need to fly or to be invincible to destroy you and your allies. But war no. Begin work. This cannot hold. How dare you? Who gave you the guts to say that? Tibia, what did you say? It doesn't matter, my king. Let us ignore this stupid boy. What are and you doing? Continue. Trust me, my king. I command you to leave this body now! Leave! Leave and never come back again! Leave! Leave! Leave this body now! Leave! So, so you've been the one tormenting this soul! He belongs to me! And so does everything that has breath! in this kingdom. Leave and never come back to this kingdom again. Leave! Ebube! Leave us alone and we shall spare your life. You will never do anything. Leave, I command you. Come back! Come back and finish! What is this horror we just witnessed now? My king, he is the healer. The chief priest talked about. How did you know this? <laughs> the chief priest came to me severally in the dream. He told me to go and look for a healer. And I went in search of him. Here he is. Does it mean we don't have anything to fear anymore? He will never come back. Dicky said he destroyed all those monsters many years ago. He slept with her and carried her spirit into this kingdom. What? I didn't know. What about the priest? 
speak. He knew too much. Because of that, they killed him. They wanted to regain control. They even threatened to kill me and my family. The betrothal and marriage was part of their game scheme. That is why they sealed the queen's womb. That made it impossible for her to conceive a mere child. Please help me. Help me. They are dragging me out of the world. Help me. No, no, no. Help me. Father, no, no, no. You will not die. You will. You will. My father will not die. You will. My father will not die. Father, no, 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 no. My mama will. Oh, you will. My mama will. My mama will. Father. Wake up now, my mom! Please help him, please! Father! Father! Oh! Take it easy, take it easy! No, you don't understand! My mom will see that! Did I see that? Igwe! Mama, mama, talk to father now! Father! Father! Oh! Father, father, give me your Father, no, 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 my mama! Igwe! Igwe, Igwe, Igwe! Give this to the princess. She will get stronger by morning. a bad doctor. You were supposed to come and check on your patient first thing in the morning. Because the doctor knows that she's strong enough to walk up to him and say, I am finally free. Hey, <laughs> Bube. You have your way with words. You look strong. Well, all thanks to your healing power. I would have died if not for an intervention. Thanks to the gods. Okay, I should go now. Oh, wait. Do you find me repulsive? Why do you run away each time I come to you? Because you're better off without me. Don't you love me? I do, but... But what? I don't know. I don't think it's right. I'm sorry, my princess. I'm sorry. If I feel so sad, Father. How can I love a man who doesn't love me? Am I that ugly, Father? Am I such a bad princess? Oh, no, princess. Far from it. You are beautifully and wonderfully made. In fact, you are the synergy of all eyes in Ugwe and beyond. But he doesn't see me that way. He said he loves me, but... He feels the whole thing is not right. Please, Father. Talk to him. Tell him that there is nothing wrong with a princess marrying a Dibia. Please, Father. Please. Which one? 
I was going to your place. Greetings, my king. Greetings, great one. Why have you refused the comfort of the palace? You deserve a place at the palace. Great things you have done for us. Is the king asking me to marry the princess? Great one, you will not just be honoring me and my household, but the entire kingdom at large. Let's give honor to whom honor is due. You deserve the beautiful gift that Ugweke Kingdom has to offer, which is the princess. Ah, well, that does not mean you cannot marry any other woman if you so desire. I'll be waiting. Don't keep the king waiting, great one. By the powers conferred on me, as the king of Ugweke, I hereby... Ebube, what are you doing? Huh? Ne. What are you doing here? I heard you want to commit sacrilege, and I've come to stop it. Sacrilege? How? Greetings, my king. Two decades ago, my daughter came back to me from Mugweke. supposed to be here. You sought to serve the king. So what happened? Why? Are you, what are you doing here? Under this rain? What are you doing? I am tired. I need water. Okay. Okay. Come, come inside. been like this since you came back. Since two market days ago you came back. You've been like this. And you have refused to talk to me or tell me the reason for leaving the palace. My daughter, what happened? Talk to me. I'm your mother, please. Please talk to me. I'm your mother. <coughs> they did nothing to me. They did nothing to me. So this is why you came back. This is why you came back, Uluama. Who is responsible? I don't want to talk about it, Nne. You have to talk about it. Uluama, you have to talk about it. He has to take responsibility for the child. But I don't want him to take responsibility for the child. If you don't want me in your house, just tell me I will leave. That's not what I mean. You're my child. I love you. But... I don't just want this child to come forth without a father. Please, tell me. Nay, we will be fine without him. 
Something, something happened between the king and I. I, I, I could kill you for what you just did. I know my king. You took the sacred wine. You are touching the king. I know. Let's go inside. Shame on the God. Let me take you inside. Was a mistake. You must protect my homeborn child, and you must call him a bube. Then he shall be called a bube. Okay. I'm dying. You're not dying. You mean Uloma was with child? Yes. Uloma was with child. Did you do it? I was sober after we lost our twins to steal Beth. everybody to go. Guys, everybody. I don't want to see anybody. I want to be alone. What are you doing here? I'm sorry, my king. But you've been like this for so long. <laughs> I am king. I do what pleases me. No one asks me any questions. Because pleases the gods not to give me an heir to the throne. <laughs> But my king, it is not your fault. Like he said, it is their fault. Ah. Shame the gods can give a king an heir to the throne. Shame on them. My king, 
they know better. They will give you an air in due time. But I think you've had enough now. Hey! Shh! Shh! I am king. I'm the one who decides when it is enough. No other person talks. Not enough? Can give me an air? When it is enough? I'm the My one king. who knows. My king. I, I, I could kill you for what you just did. I know my king. You took the sacred one. You are touching the king. I know. Let's go inside. Say, on the God. Let me take you inside. Sent for me, my king. Yes. Leave us. It shouldn't have happened. I love the queen so much. How would I stand before her? what I did. I understand, my king. I have to go pack my things and get going. I'm sorry I put you in this position. It is not your fault, my king. I let down my guide for you. I took advantage of your situation. It was a great honor and privilege serving you, my king. So the king has a son from Oloma. So the healer here is actually the king's son. Ebube. It simply means that the, the, the priest was right when he predicted that uh, the healer would come from the royal household. He was right. Yes. Ebube is the king's son. Noon days when I saw you the first time, you look just like your mother. 
Welcome, my son. Welcome home. So you are my brother. No wonder you always said your feelings wasn't right. Maybe. The king has an heir. May the gods be praised. Cha cha cha. Ugweke. Kwenu. Yeah. Kwenu. Yeah. Kwenu. Where are the drummers? Yes. Bring out the drinks. Let us celebrate. Let the celebration commence. <laughs> Let the celebration begin. Bring the music. Bring the drinks. What you ask me for today? One minute. I might not have an answer to give today. Again. And as I will work again. As I know. I plead on behalf of my father. Be careful. My king. There is this saying in Igbo that na e wala ke be ti won da gbe fe e wala ka ni gbochi ati my father dey call uno make the very big mistake oh my king if you can take our mind back we say that my father did everything when possible to save this land he fought the beast he conquered demons, witches, wizards. But I believe that his mistake was not intentional. My king, I will be very happy, I'll be a happy man, if the honor that my father deserved will be given to me. Ezenna, you have spoken well. Thank Indeed, you. your father was a very great man. He was. He made his mistakes. However, I had given my word. The honor that was supposed to be given to him shall be given to you so that you can move around freely like a free man. I would also discuss with the elders in council. We shall also arrange for a defeating burial for your father. Thank you, my friend. You, 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 you truly spoke out. You can make live long. Maybe I had a wrong impression about you. I thought you to be silly, arrogant, proud. But when I heard you talk earlier today, I probably was wrong about you. Does that mean that the princess loves me? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I want you to walk me to my favorite place at the break of dawn. If that will make you happy. Don't you think pulling me closer will make me happier? What 
are you waiting for? His destiny to be great. His destiny to be higher. When you're not here soon.